Hello and welcome back to Endless Learning. Today, we are going to kick off our new AI class focusing on Stable Diffusion. Stable Diffusion is a deep learning model specifically engineered for generating and manipulating digital images. In this session, we will guide you through the process of installing Stable Diffusion. Stable Diffusion is an artificial intelligence model capable of creating images from textual descriptions, similar to Midjourney. We have already completed a video about Midjourney, and if you're interested, I will include a card for you to check out the playlist. First, you'll need to create an account on github.com to download the main setup for the Stable Diffusion setup. Type Stable Diffusion. Click the first link scroll down. You'll need to install specific software, including Python and Git. The installation steps vary depending on your operating system. Then, download and begin the installation of Git. Simply proceed through the installation by clicking Next at each step, as you would typically do. GitHub is a web-based platform for version control and collaboration, allowing users to manage projects, track changes, and work together on software development. It combines the distributed version control functionality of Git with its own features, supporting both public and private repositories. Founded in 2008, GitHub has become a key tool for developers worldwide. In 2018, it was acquired by Microsoft. At the end of the installation process, select Launch and then Finish. This action will open the terminal. Next, we will proceed with the installation process. We need to first create a folder to store the stable diffusion files. After creating the folder, we'll change our current directory to this new location. To do this in the terminal, type cda backslash stable diffusion. The cd too many arguments error typically occurs if there are spaces in the directory path without enclosing the path in quotes. For such paths, enclose them in quotes to avoid this error. Now it's changed to new directory. Next, we need to download the stable diffusion setup. Copy and paste the provided command into your git bash terminal and wait for the installation to complete. This git clone command will clone the files from the repository to your local folder. Next, we download and install Python go to Python website. Ensuring it's exactly version 3.10.6 due to compatibility issues with newer versions and Torch. Make sure to select the checkbox option during installation to add Python to your system path. Before launching the program, edit the web user batch file by opening it in Notepad and typing git pull to ensure you have the latest updates. Save the changes and launch the file which will download and install all required dependencies. After the installation, a local URL for accessing the Stable Diffusion interface will be displayed. Copy and paste this URL into your browser to access the Stable Diffusion interface. We have successfully installed Stable Diffusion. Currently, we have access to only two models. If you wish to explore additional styles, please visit civitai.com to download more models. After downloading, you need to copy the file into this following Stable Diffusion folder. Then return to the Stable Diffusion website and refresh the page. Now, you should be able to see the new models in the drop-down menu. Stable Diffusion can be installed not only on a local computer, but also on cloud computing platforms. You have the option to install Stable Diffusion on Amazon and Google Colab as well. This provides flexibility in choosing the installation method that best suits your needs, whether you prefer local installation for personal use or cloud-based solutions for enhanced computing power and accessibility. We hope this guide has been informative and helpful. If you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Endless Learning for more insightful tutorials and discussions on AI and technology. Your support helps us to continue creating content that empowers you to harness the latest advancements in AI and beyond. Thank you for watching, 